my previous video, I explained to you how to measure the current of an electric fan. Now, in this video, I'm going to show you how to measure the voltage of the current going to an electrical appliance. So, before I continue, don't forget to subscribe to my channel, tell your friends, link them up, and then let's learn together. Okay, so if you are measuring voltage, a voltmeter is connected in power. Alright, so in the case of voltage measurement, we have to place our voltmeter in power. Power means that it is connected across between live and then neutral. All right, so let's look at it practically. Okay, so this is the multimeter. This is our load. And then this is our supply, live and neutral to the load. Okay, in voltage measurement, unlike the current where we needed to break one line, in the measurement of voltage, we are not breaking any line. And generally, whatever voltage is present at the supply is what will be supplied to your appliance. All right. So there is no need peeling off the cables of your circuit to take measurement. You just have to identify the source of supply, supply your appliance, and then you can take your voltage measurements there. All right. But for clarity, We'll just do it as we did in the drawing. So, all right. So before we continue, we have to get our meter ready for testing. Okay. So here, in this case, we are measuring voltage. And so we, can, we are going to use this port and then this port might come. So it means this one, we can use it to measure voltage. All right. So our red lead will be connected to uh, this port and then our neutral to this one so this is our red to this then our neutral to come all right then also we have to uh, locate the voltage setting on the multimeter and then we tune our knob to the voltage setting here we have voltage here we have the symbol for voltage here pin this is alternating voltage. We have another voltage here, but this is direct voltage. Now, our alternating voltage can measure between 200 millivolts up to 750 volts. And I, I will have to quickly say again that anytime you are taking measurements on a circuit, you should have an idea of the amount of voltage that you are expecting. For instance, in Ghana, the low voltage range is 230 volts. So, if you are taking a measurement on this circuit, you should make sure that you tune your knob to a voltage that is probably higher than what you are measuring. So, here, our knob is on 750 volts before we start the measurement. Okay. So, you have red and black. You have red and black. So, red, you go to red, and black, you go to black. Across line... And neutral. All right. So we have two hundred and thirty-five volts. All right. So that is how to measure the voltage in an electrical circuit. If you want to give a feedback, if you want to ask a question, you can simply go to the comment section and then let me know what you have to ask. Thank you very much. We we'll meet another time.